This training will help you identify and understand the procedures associated with new airspace rules in effect for certain helicopters operating along the North Shore of Long Island in New York. This training will also provide additional information related to the route in order to ensure pilots are knowledgeable of the rule requirements, recommendations to fly the route safely, and what deviation allowances may be available to you. The regulatory requirement for this route is contained in Title 14 of the Code of Federal Regulations, Part 93, Subpart H. Subpart H prescribes a special air traffic rule for civil helicopters operating VFR along the North Shore, Long Island, New York. The regulations state, unless otherwise authorized, each person piloting a helicopter along Long Island's northern shoreline between BP LYD Waypoint and Orient Point shall utilize the North Shore helicopter route at or above the altitude as published. The FAA recognizes the varying capabilities of helicopters, and this rule permits pilots to deviate from the rule for safety, weather, or when transitioning to or from a destination or point of landing. Under Section 91.3, the pilot in command is directly responsible for and is the final authority as to the operation of the aircraft. Therefore, if flight along this route places a helicopter beyond the auto rotation performance distance to the shore, the pilot is permitted to deviate from the specified route and altitude. The mandatory portion of the route begins at VP LYD Waypoint, located approximately 20 nautical miles northeast of LaGuardia International Airport and extends to the eastern end of Long Island at Orient Point. Since this route is a VFR route, all VFR requirements contained in Title 14 of the Code of Federal Regulations apply at all times. Therefore, it is important for pilots to comply with both Sections 91103 and 91113. Section 91103, Pre-Flight Action, states, each pilot in command shall, before beginning a flight, become familiar with all available information concerning that flight while Section 91113 describes right-of-way rules and in part says, when weather conditions permit, regardless of whether an operation is conducted under instrument flight rules or visual flight rules, vigilance shall be maintained by each person operating an aircraft so as to see and avoid other aircraft. When a rule of this section gives another aircraft the right-of-way, the pilot shall give way to that aircraft and may not pass over, under, or ahead of it unless well clear. The New York helicopter route chart will be updated to depict the new route. Additionally, a notice to airmen, or NOTAM, will be issued and will provide the operational requirements and recommended safety procedures outlined in this video. The New York North Shore helicopter route should be flown as charted, which is approximately one mile north of the Long Island Northern Shoreline. However, for safety of flight, it is recommended that pilots using GPS or other similar equipment fly a quarter mile right offset when flying eastbound or westbound on the charted course to avoid potential oncoming traffic. Unless otherwise authorized or unable to comply with the new airspace rule for safety reasons, when flying between VP LYD Waypoint and Orient Point, helicopters are required to fly at or above 2,500 feet MSL. Please note that the rule does not require helicopters flying along this route to maintain exactly 2,500 feet MSL. Because this route does not list different altitudes for oncoming traffic, in order to ensure safe aircraft operations, it is recommended that pilots traveling eastbound on the route maintain odd altitudes in 100-foot increments at or above 2,500 feet MSL. Conversely, pilots traveling westbound on the route are encouraged to maintain even altitudes in 100-foot increments at or above 2,600 feet MSL. VFR pilots are cautioned that there are heavy concentrations of IFR jet operations between 2,000 and 4,000 feet in the same area as indicated on the Long Island helicopter chart. For this reason, it is also recommended that pilots monitor New York approach control while operating on the route and provide position reports in the blind to other VFR traffic on frequency 123.45 along the route. Finally, it is recommended that pilots and operators using this route make their helicopters as visible as possible to other air traffic. This could include installation and use of high-intensity anti-collision lights, turning on all available external lights, such as landing or taxi lights, even during daytime operations on this route, high-visibility main and tail rotor blade paint, and avionics supporting TCAS alerting and or ADSB position identification. In review, 
The North Shore route is a VFR route, which means all VFR rules apply. Helicopters flying between VP LYD waypoint and Orient Point should maintain 2,500 feet MSL or above and remain approximately one mile north of the Long Island Northern Shoreline. As with all visual flight rules operations, pilots operating on this route should be vigilant in their scanning to see and avoid other aircraft. Additional questions regarding operations in this airspace can be directed to your local Flight Standards District Office. Thank you for watching this video and fly safe.